up guys? We are heading to a Lake Jackson rotation right now. Uh, not sure what kind of a vehicle we're picking up. And they just said it was a car. Apparently it hit a mailbox and ripped the tire off. So I, as far as I know, it's a single vehicle accident. Um, don't really know too much more than that. Um, let me know how well you're hearing me right now. Um, trying something different with this uh, front facing camera here so uh, let me know how well you can hear me on this one and uh, here in just a second I'll show you what I got going on so we'll be over there here in just a second thanks for watching guys alright we're about to be pulling up to this wreck here I don't know how you can see it this is my uh, in cab view camera I got a media mod and a light mod for it so that way I can uh, film the uh, interior shots at night and it also has a mic with the little windsock stuff to hopefully pick up the sound better and stuff for you guys so let me know how that's doing the wreck should be right here right there Bricks one on that one, huh? Yeah, figured I'll let y'all know before you got here. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. <laughs> Be suck to show up with a a wheel lift on that. Yeah. Not, I mean, you could still tow it, but it'd be a little bit, a little bit harder trying to get underneath it. Busy. Busy? Yeah. Busy at the beach? I hadn't even, I hadn't made not a single trip out there. I, I actually spent, last night I worked a, uh, just a couple little kind of dumb calls. Yeah. And uh, then today I've been doing nothing but hauling Con X's and sheds. Nice. I guess everybody decided they need to get all their stuff moved around for the three day weekend. Yeah. So. <laughs> arm that I can grab. Grab up high. Get the keys, um, keys port. Right. Yeah, the keys. Can I get anything else you need out there, Dylan? Yeah. <clears throat> you. Yeah. Yeah. If you if you decide there's something you need else out of it, you can always get it from the yard too, so no big deal. Right. That door probably don't open too well. 
probably gonna have to block that uh, block that tire once it gets up on the bed. Move over to this side so I can watch how this side transfers up on the bed. I might have to block it up. so that it slides straight. Can't put it in park because the other side's damaged. Probably isn't going to do anything for this thing. Because the other side's damaged. Most modern vehicles have an open differential. Even in park, this wheel will still want to roll. Because of the open differential. This is why I set the e-brake, because it would uh, essentially want to roll away from me. Get a couple straps on her. I'll get that in just a second.
That won't help just a whole lot, but it'll help a little bit. Let me grab my broom. The airbags are up. I got you, bud. It's all right. You're good. I appreciate it, though. Oh, I'm, I'll get the <laughs> I know, I know. I get it. They get a uh, record slip or anything? No. No? Okay. <sighs> okay. Uh, you'll need a business card or anything for where the car is going? Or? Okay. Let me grab you one. Stash my broom. Angleton address, that's where our yard's at. Okay. And then it's got our phone numbers and stuff on there. Okay. Does the car have insurance and stuff on it or? It's liability now. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, that's that's our. All right. Yeah. So, just uh, any of those numbers there, you can get a hold of our dispatchers and stuff. So, okay. Thank you. No problem. Make sure he's good with me. Y'all good with me? Good to go? Be good? All right, appreciate it, guys. talking about on the scanner right now how the uh, beaches are so busy right now they're shutting them down different accesses as they get too full uh, so this is one of the few wrecks we've worked this weekend already uh, thankfully nothing too bad has happened yet heard a few pretty bad wrecks they talked about but nothing too bad so, we're hauling this thing to the yard and we'll be over there here shortly. Just want to take a brief moment because it's Memorial Day weekend to thank all of our uh, military personnel and veterans and all the ones that gave their lives defending this country. So let's not forget what the meaning of Memorial Day weekend is. 
hope everybody's having a good, safe weekend. And uh, we'll be over here at the yard here in just a minute to get this thing unloaded. Thanks for watching, guys. See this burn up camper here. We uh, just worked that one a few hours ago. Not even probably a couple hours ago. Uh, didn't get to record that one, but it caught fire uh, going down the road. So we had to load it up on our land all and call it. Get this thing unloaded here. going to use this uh, ratchet here try to uh, straighten up that wheel and tire since the steering is jammed on it all right looks like it's gonna pop for us so I have to uh, use the old wood block trick to get that to slide off for us. That right there. steering being jammed like it is it uh doesn't really want to straighten the wheels up but because this uh axle's damaged here i can't just put the car into park and uh just slide it off like i normally would because the uh most modern vehicles like this have a uh, open differential and when the axle isn't uh, attached anymore the uh, even though it's in the transmission is in part the uh, differential will still spin because like this side will stop moving but the other side will want to rotate the other direction And because it's damaged, it's not in park. So, not at the wheels anyway. We're going to see how this does. We might have to back up a little bit more. We'll see how well it wants to shake off. If it doesn't want to shake off too easy, what I'll do is I'll back up, set the parking brake, and then walk out from underneath it which I found is generally easier but we'll see how this works yeah, yeah it's not gonna go I'm gonna try to get as much angle out of this thing as I can because the wheel is sliding and not rolling it's not going in the direction that it turns that's what I was expecting right there
So, what I'm gonna do, rather than winch it back up and move back, I'm just gonna push the car around with my bed. I'll show you what I'm gonna do here. is now rolling as the fender liner came out from underneath it finally so we're gonna block this one too and now both front tires are sliding and not rolling all right we got that right at the end of our bed. Probably go out just a little bit more with it. So now I need to uh, re engage my wedge here. So I'm going to hold pressure. And I'm going to release the parking brake. That way the car will want to roll. The back tires want to roll. I'm just going to push the bed back out. That way it pushes the whole vehicle out. I'm not walking the truck right now. I'm literally just using the bed to push back. That's where I want it. Of course, if you need to, I can walk the truck back a little bit. Get a little bit extra push out of it. Locks out from underneath it now. We'll just off of it. Go ahead and get the rest of my stuff put up here. Good to do a finish up my paperwork and all that and be ready for whatever the holiday weekend brings us next. Appreciate you guys for watching. If y'all would, please subscribe, like, and share.